can tell you this, the best thing I ever did in my, for my company is had morning meetings. The morning meeting, even though you're spending $200 a day on this morning meeting, uh, it comes back and because- Yeah, you know, how much do you think that saves and makes you over time? I can't even dramatic. tell you, yeah. um, you know, but I can tell you that every month for 20 straight months, we've had continuous growth. Um, we've been um, hitting every single number uh, that we're looking for. It helps the guys understand how to behave in the homes, and and it kind of gives them a, you know, from a different perspective. Not just me telling them, but Eric tells them in the morning, this is the way you should probably do things. Um, but for the most part, the guys enjoy it. I did a little survey, informal survey last week, and I said, hey, listen, all in favor of continuing with the morning tech meetings, I want on the count of three, because I never like say, put your hand up by yeah. saying, on the count of three, everybody put their hand up if you want to continue. And they all put their hand up, so. My name's Jordan, I'm with Longo Carpet Cleaning. Uh, the meetings have helped me build teamwork <laughs> skills and uh, it's definitely helped my communication skills. Like my clients and uh, all the other employees, my coworkers. I come in every morning and I'm, I'm looking forward to it. Everyone else on the team looks forward to it as well. The upselling has definitely improved, I think, among everyone. So that helps a lot. And then we'll talk about what it means to these guys in their life, you know, what it means to have integrity and have a passion and have, a, you know, be honesty and things like that. So we just kind of drill these things into everybody every single day, you know. The, and then, you know, Eric has the same type of flair with the, the tech talk. And because he came back from a carpet cleaning type of, uh, uh, his background is carpet and restoration, carpet cleaning and restoration. We can relate to how, what we go through on a daily basis. So, uh, culture is everything in our company because um, if you have antagonizing forces every day in the in the whole neighborhood here, uh, jobs don't go well. People don't get along. We start at seven fifty-five in the morning, trying to get out of here by eight twenty, eight twenty-five. The latest. Everybody in the company bought into what we're trying to accomplish. And unless um, there was just one guy we had that was not really part of it, and he was part of the old system that we had more or less, and he resisted a lot of these changes, and, uh, and he left. But other than that, nobody's really left. Good.